Hey y'all, it's Mina. Today for dinner, I made a yummy Pittsburgh salad. Yes, you heard me right, Pittsburgh salad, y'all. Where we at? We're in Pittsburgh. <laughs> so, a Pittsburgh salad is really simple. It's a basic salad. Lettuce, tomato, a little bit of onion, um, cucumber, and now traditionally it has grilled meat, either grilled steak, grilled chicken, whatever. But today we're gonna do rotisserie chicken, okay? And we're gonna recook that. We're gonna, you know, put it in a frying pan with a little more seasonings and we're gonna do seasoned fries. Yes, y'all, that's what makes this the Pittsburgh salad is the seasoned fries on top. Oh my goodness, if you've never had this, you gotta try it. <laughs> like I said, it's super easy, y'all. Just a basic salad, and but you got to top it with the most delicious fries ever. So that's what we're doing here. We're going to season these fries with salt, pepper, garlic powder, a little bit of that caramelized onion seasoning, some smoked paprika, and also a little bit of parsley. Super easy, y'all. And we're going to put a little bit of either cornstarch or flour and toss those around. And you'll see this gives, oh my goodness, best fries ever. Seriously, if you've never had your fries like this, you have got to try this. And with that exact seasoning combo, y'all, I'm telling you, it's out of this world. <laughs> you will thank me later. Promise. Okay, and I'm only doing, this is for two people, just, just me and hubby. Everybody else wants leftover spaghetti. <laughs> so, I'm going to do just these couple fries. I, um, I peeled and cut up three potatoes for two people. And like I said, I have some rotisserie chicken from the other day. And I'm going to slice up some pieces of that. Well, chop up some pieces of that. And we're going to use a little bit of that oil from those fries that we cooked and we're going to put that in a pan look how beautiful those fries are y'all look at how perfect those fries are and i'm going to salt those just a little bit because we already did all that seasoning you know so like i said we're going to go in with that same oil that we use uh, to cook the fries in and we're going to just toss that chicken around and just heat that up a little bit because it was cold in the fridge it was rotisserie chicken you know left over okay now to season this you know rotisserie chicken is usually always you know pretty flavorful so just a little tiny bit of salt and some garlic powder really simple guys And, um, you know, you don't have to even redo this chicken. If you don't mind your chicken cold in your chicken salad, you know, in your salad, hey, do your thing. But I like to have my fries and my meat hot, you know. So we're going to go ahead and you can chop your lettuce and your veggies however you like them. This is how I like to do mine. <laughs> you know, kind of a rough chop. And y'all see me just slapping. You should see my floor. I had like salad everywhere. <laughs> Oh my goodness. I wish one of these days, you guys, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you my kitchen like after I get done cooking and seasoning my table. Y'all know I like to season my table very well. <laughs> okay, so we're going to peel. And I had somebody question me about the way I peeled my um, cucumbers once. Look, everybody does things a certain way. This to me is just so much easier and you don't take a whole heck of a lot off you know and because I almost always cut myself when I use the the peeler so I like to use a knife and this is how I do mine you know so you know sue me whatever <laughs> okay so we're gonna chop these up pretty small too I try to make everything pretty uniform you know all the squares or whatever the same size and like I said, it really doesn't matter, you know, what your shapes or whatever, what they look like. But look, the key is those fries on top, y'all. Okay, so to season the salad part, I'm just doing salt, pepper, a little bit of garlic powder. Y'all, like I said, this is so basic and so simple. 
but I'm pretty sure there's probably a lot of people out there that have never had a salad with fries in it. It is truly a Pittsburgh thing. We started it here in Pittsburgh. Yes, we did. <laughs> you can argue with me if you want to. I'm telling you, it started here. And actually, guys, this whole week, well, the rest of the week, I'm going to continue to do um, Pittsburgh meals. Okay, so tune in, you know, for the week. And you'll see some of the other things that we like here, you know, in my city. A lot of the things originated here and some of the things are just things that, you know, we just kind of took on. But, y'all, yeah, this right here is the one. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh, and the cheese, y'all. I had grated up some smoked Gouda. Yes, you can put whatever kind of cheese you like. You know, there's no specific kind. And the dressing, you're supposed to traditionally use ranch. But Hubby is, he he's a fan of both. So, you know, I put a little bit of Italian on his and just a pinch of, you know, just a few drops of ranch. And here we have it, y'all. A delicious Pittsburgh salad. So, guys, try this out. Let me know how you like it. Thank you for watching. And as always, stay blessed.